Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you're viewing from. This is Laura Thompson, your friendly, fabulous, feisty, fierce, and phenomenal CEO and creator of TAN TV, the African American Network, where we have a local feel with the global reach, and you're tuned into the coffee break, and I know that was a mouthful. Uh, we're sitting here with Danielle. She's the director, the producer, the playwright, all of that uh, for a play called The King. The King. <laughs> so how you doing, Danielle? Phenomenal. How are you? The I'm fabulous. Doing... <laughs> <laughs> Phenomenal. Fant fantastic. Amazing. Right. <laughs> So Ms. Laura Thompson, oh, I'm good. <laughs> so before we get started, can you thank you for joining me on the coffee break? By the way, I, I don't let too many people join me. Well, for I'm the happy break. I could be here. Right. So before we get started with the interview, I, if you could just give us a little biographical information on you, who you are, where you're from, what you do, why you do it, okay. all that good stuff. Well, again, my name is Danielle Gully. I'm the writer, director, and producer of this phenomenal production that's coming to San Antonio called The King. I am the CEO of Perpetual mm -hmm. Innovations Entertainment, where uh, we produce and direct amazing productions that really bring light into the community and just really excited to be doing some amazing work this year um, for the city of San Antonio, Selma, Shirts, and, <laughs> and you know, getting an opportunity to really reach globally and hit people all over the country. Wow. Well, she's always done phenomenal work. She probably didn't think of it like, like that at first when she just when she first started out, no, but <laughs> she, she's always done phenomenal work. So tell us about this production, The King. What is so special about this production? You know, it is probably one of the most creative pieces that I've ever written and it's family oriented it is it's fun it's exciting especially during this time of you know we're getting away from COVID a little bit now and people have been in their homes for about two years and it's, it's like crazy. oh my goodness I just need to laugh I need to dance I need to do something <laughs> and this production brings that back um, it it, it kind of makes you feel like okay before COVID we can have fun we could get together we can be unified and and laugh together and sing together. And that's what this production is going to bring to, to the entire city of San Antonio. It's a Christmas production. So if you love Christmas time, this is definitely something you want to come out to with your families and just really enjoy the message because there's a powerful message. We have phenomenal actors um, and musicians and dancers that are a part of this production that's going to just electrify the city. Wow. So, and, and she's not kidding either, because there's a couple <laughs> that's going to be a part of this production that I know a lot of you know who they are. So tell us about, you know, you got some national gospel performing artists that are yes. going to be a part of this. So tell us about that. So honored, so honored to have David and Tamala Mann wow. um, a part of this production, not just coming in doing like one minute of something, doing a cameo. They are a part wow. of this production. And um, it, it's been a true blessing to have them connect with my company and get a chance to meet some of the local cast members that we have here. For those that don't know, David and Tamala Mann are with the Tyler Perry Studios. They have been in almost every national stage play wow. that they've um, put on, as well as television, uh, sitcoms and film and I mean Tamala is also a recording artist as you mentioned a gospel recording artist wow. and they also put a, a R&B love album together as a couple and so they are just I consider them the king and queen of the stage again very just um, honored to be working with them and to allow our cast members to be working with people of their caliber. And not just them, we have a guy by the name of Deontay Wyatt, who's playing wow. the character of Grinch. And he is an executive assistant at Tyler Perry Studios. He's an actor within his own right. He was wow. in uh, Freedom Writers. It's a movie that a lot of people have seen years ago with Hilary Swank. Hmm. And he was one of the star uh, actors in that movie as well. So, I mean, we just really have a phenomenal cast. Wow, so that's just testament of you and the phenomenal writer, producer, uh, and director that you are. That just did not happen by happenstance. It's because of the work that you've done prior to this right. that has led up to this. 
Thank such you. a time like this. And such so, a time like this. <laughs> <laughs> so, you know, I, I really, I, I've heard of uh, David and Tamala, but I forgot that they were part of the, the Tyler Perry uh, family. Right, right. It, and it just so happened that, that that's how it worked out with having three major components of Tyler Perry's camp a part of this production. Um, I've known Deonce for years before he started working with uh, Tyler Perry. He and I were, was in a production in in um, Dallas, Texas together wow. about 12, 13 years ago. Wow. And when I wrote this production, I said, man, I need somebody that can play this character and bring it to life and somebody that's not afraid of the stage and that can wow the audience. And I just remember the performance we had years ago. And I said, man, I got to find out where he is. Mm -hmm. Found him. Had no idea he was in Atlanta because he was living in California at the time, into Atlanta, and he said, "You know what, Danielle, I'm there." Wow! And at the time, we took we did the production first in Maryland, and it was a phenomenal show then. And now it has grown, and the production value is even bigger and better. Um, I'm looking forward to definitely um, putting San Antonio on the map as it pertains to a uh, live theater going national out of this city. Wow, and it, it's going just there. I, I was just speaking with someone and they said, I know her, uh, I know Danielle, but I, I remember <clears throat> when you came to the TAN TV studios uh, uh, several years ago, mm -hmm. um, and I read the, the, the name of the play on your flyer. Right. And I was like, wow, we got to interview this lady. We got to find out what this play is all about. <laughs> that was why good girls become bad boys. <laughs> right. But, but I love that play. I loved it. Thank you. I loved it. And so, uh, you know, what can people expect and how many shows? Are you going to have one? one we show? have one power packed performance and it's going to be at the real life ample theater on december 4th at 7 30. Um, wow. it's a large venue it's an open air venue wow. um, the weather is slated to be amazing and we're gonna knock on wood and pray that everything is perfect just the way that it's supposed to be but it is going to be an awesome production and again it's going to be at the real life ample theater in selma wow so how can people learn more about it without us telling them on uh on the air, what, where can they go to, to learn more about the, the production? Absolutely, they can go to my website. They can go to www.daniellegully.com and you can get all the information about the show, see the um, existing reel from the show to see what it's about, the content. It is a dynamic production as it pertains to uh, being able to go into your mind. Wow. And that's what the story um, resembles. It's a young lady by the name of Nikki, that's her character. She goes into her soul and she meets the different parts of her personality. So faith, grace, knowledge, joy, doubt. And she's in her efforts to go meet the king in order to make it back home. So you're going to take this amazing journey with Nikki um, throughout this production of The King. Wow. So so by chance, uh, are you performing in this? I am not, but I feel like I <laughs> am because as the writer, uh, to see all the people on stage, including um, the Grinch, who's played by Deonce, and, and Santa Claus, who's played by David Mann, and Spirit, who's played by Tamala Mann, and Scrooge, who's played by this amazing guy named Kurt Wilkinson, to see all of these characters on stage, I feel like I'm on stage because they are breathing life into the very words that I've written. Wow. So this is... It's so unbelievably fulfilling to be able to see the characters, um, the, hear the songs that we've written, and to see them dancing. Wow. So yeah, I'm on stage. I'm just not physically mm -hmm. on stage. Wow. <laughs> so is this a um, um, the all of the music is original? Yes. Wow. Yes. Wow. And I have some amazing writers. Plugs to them. Janae Jackson and Mallory Jackson and Kayla wow. Garner, um, my writing team, who has just been plugging away and Paul Cockfield and Steve Johnson. <laughs> well, I'm just going to predict that Tyler Perry is going to pick it up and, and 
put it on the big screen. Well, all right. <laughs> we'll receive. <laughs> but, but thank you so much for, for coming and hanging out with me on the coffee break. Thank you. Uh, for a little bit. You know, we're running out of time, but tell them again where they can go and find out more information. Yes, please go to www.daniellegully.com and you can find out everything about Perpetual Innovations, which is the company, my company that is producing this show and a little bit more about me and the whole production. It is going to blow you away. You don't want to miss it. Wow, you don't want to miss it. You've been tuned into the coffee break, and thank you so much for coming out. Thank you. And having a little bit of coffee with me. Oh, (laughs) yeah. Ciao.